what's up everyone welcome and or welcome back to my channel if you are new welcome my name is mara y'all i am so sorry this video is going up so late i know i've been gone but i'm back and i'm better and i'm better <laughs> um this video is actually supposed to go up on tuesday but we got hit with that hurricane on tuesday and we haven't had power ever since up until today today's friday um i'll try to get this out on sunday but we were struggling for those four days so please bear with me so as you guys can see we doing a little sum sum with an avocado and it was supposed to be a diy mask which it kind of sort of was but y'all it was a mess it was nasty and i probably will never do it again in my life but the main reasoning for me trying to do the avocado mask is because avocados they do have a lot a lot a lot of benefits they have protein they're supposed to help with moisture with shine with breakage with moisture retention um length retention it's supposed to do all of these type of wonderful things to your hair and of course y'all know i'm about that healthy hair natural hair long lifestyle so i wanted to be a part of it and yeah i learned my lesson pretty much so if you are new welcome make sure you guys subscribe again my name is mara thank you so much for stopping by if you if you're not new welcome back um but yeah we're gonna we're gonna get right into this video and i hope you guys like it Okay, so first things first, now that we have our avocado blended and you guys see me add an egg, I'm currently adding in some honey for some extra moisture and shine. But just to go over some benefits of an avocado and using it in your hair, because it is that type of fruit that is just packed with so many vitamins. Um, so starting off, it nourishes your hair. Um, it's supposed to strengthen your hair, for example, if you have a lot of breakage or if you have a lot of shedding, it's supposed to help with that. It's supposed to help repair damaged hair. Um, it's also supposed to help moisturize, which is what i mainly did it for and i also noticed that a lot of people use it to uh, deep condition in a sense of trying to get their hair to clump together so that's also what i used it for and it's also supposed to help revitalize your hair so it's not supposed to make it look as dull it's supposed to help it look shinier and just make it look healthier overall in my mixture i also added in some grapeseed oil and jojoba oil um if you don't know those two oils it's definitely really good for your hair because not only does it help add moisture back into your hair and help moisturize your hair but it's also supposed to help your hair grow as well um so i did add very little amounts of those because i wasn't exactly sure how everything was going to mix together i didn't want it to get clumpy or anything like that so i did just pretty much eye it when i was adding the two oils in and then like i said i added in an egg also all right so as y'all can see i'm adding in my mixture to clean wash and conditioned hair um and i'm pretty much just applying it like i would apply any other deep conditioner but by my face i'm pretty sure y'all can already see what's happening right now um this mixture didn't smell the best i'm not sure if that's how an avocado just smells on a regular i don't eat avocados i don't i don't fool with avocados there's something about green fruits they they don't sit well with me um but it stinked and i will never be doing this mixture again even though i did notice a difference in my hair i definitely noticed that my hair was more defined it was shinier it was more clumped more clump than i've ever seen my hair especially on the ends and a little bit more along the length of my hair this mixture stinked and i can also fault myself for that because i slept in it for 24 hours um with the shower cap on my head and with the towel on my head for heat so that's partially my fault so if y'all want to try this definitely don't sleep in it for 24 hours and nothing but heat but as y'all can see i'm just going in and applying it just like any other mask like i said any other deep conditioner um and as y'all can see right here like my hair is just looking 10 times better like it looks shinier it looks healthier and it just looks overall defined especially in the parts where i have a hard time defining my hair because not the full length of my hair defines i'm not sure why and over the years as my hair has gotten longer i've noticed that it's not curlier or it's not as curly but it's more so along taking a wavier texture if that makes sense so once we got all of our hair gathered, I put it in a little low bun and like I said, I slept in it for 24 hours and I couldn't find a shower cap so I used the shopping bag 
typical and then i covered the bag with a shower towel or a hair towel whatever you guys want to call it it was microfiber just in case some of my hair slipped off or the bag slipped off in the middle of the night um but of course you guys know um when your hair is exposed to some heat the cuticles on your hair shaft is going to open and all of that moisture all of those benefits from that mask is just going to draw itself in So here we are, we've made it to 24 hours and we're about to take the shower cap off of my head and by the look on my face, you guys can realize what is about to happen right now. <laughs> That's exactly what happened. My hair smelled awful and when I seen the clumps or the chunks of avocado in my hair and they just looked so dried up, it was the most disgusting thing I've ever seen and this clip just smells like rotten. I don't even know what to explain it but it smelled like a rotten fart and is definitely something that I never ever ever want to do again in my life. Alright, so once again we fresh out the shower. Normally, if I like a mask, I would leave it in my hair and just continue to style it. But for this one, I needed to get the smell out of my hair. I actually had to add more conditioner into my hair just to try to get the smell off of my scalp and try to get the chunks out of my hair. But I sprayed the main choice revitalizer spray and no matter how much I sprayed or how, what amount I sprayed in my hair, the smell was just not leaving my hair. But I was impressed with the results. As y'all can see, this is my hair after I um, put conditioner in it only. But we will never be doing that mask again. It ain't for me. I don't know, maybe it's because I left it on for 24 hours. So I may have to suck it up and try it again for a way shorter time so I can get the true, the true tea on it. But I do hope you guys like the results. This is my hair after I styled it. Please be sure to subscribe and also hit that bell so you can be notified. And also give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. And I will see you guys in my next one.